Good morgan. I'm gonna do a little experiment here. So I'm gonna test my blood ketones to see how they were impacted by alcohol. Uh, last night I had like 150 grams which is about five, uh, 4.5 ounces of whiskey. So plain whiskey with just an ice cube in it. And I'm curious to see how that impacted uh, my blood ketones. So this is like, I guess, uh, 12 hours after. And I had the whiskey over the course of a couple of hours. So let's see how it impacts uh, blood glucose and blood ketones. I have to say that uh, usually over the, ba over the past couple of weeks, my, my blood ketones were in the range of 1.5 to 4 millimolars, uh, slightly lower because of the higher protein intake. So um, much towards be or between 1.5 uh, to 2. So they were kind of lower compared to when I was doing lower protein. Uh, and uh, over the last, say, three to four weeks, I've been experimented with higher protein and I've seen ketones going lower, but I haven't been kicked out of ketosis. So that's for context. Uh, now let's see what the data says. Okay, so first we're gonna test the blood glucose. Let me just prepare the blood ketones as well because I'm gonna take from the same blood sample both of the tests okay so these are the ketone strips all right now first things first the blood glucose Okay, now let's see, 78, now let's see the ketones, so the ketone strip, okay, now let's try and get some more blood out. Okay, so seven, six, five, four, one point seven. Okay, now to give you uh, some more context, uh, I had about 16 grams of carbohydrates yesterday, so that was my total carbohydrate intake uh, plus the alcohol. So um, I've also tested with uh, wine and uh, with actually two glasses of wine and I had uh, kind of the same result so uh, not too much of a big impact on my uh, blood ketones and my blood glucose in fact I've seen a slightly decrease in blood glucose with uh, with having alcohol and when I tested for wine um, if I can recall correctly, I think I tested uh, like two or three hours after having uh, the two glasses of wine uh, and that was like five to six hours after uh, the meal. So my last meal then uh, after two hours I had two glasses of wine and that then after two or three more hours I tested for blood glucose and blood ketones and they were kind of uh, slightly below two millimolar uh, the ketones and the glucose was around 80 so not too much of a difference for me in terms of um, in terms of alcohols as impact on uh, blood ketones okay I guess this is it for this video thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one